Hello everyone, today I'm making some oatmeal, milk, and honey soap. I've made this soap before, but we're doing it again slightly differently than last year. I'm doing the oatmeal a slightly differently than I usually do it. Um, last year I pureed it with some water and made it a bit more liquid and mixed it throughout, I guess to get more of an oat milk. But this year I kind of left it kind of chunky and I will just be stick blending it to uh, make sure there's no clumps or anything like that. I actually don't remember where I got this habit from to uh, puree the oats in advance since some people usually add them in raw. But the thing I like the most about this is that there's no, there's no really no need to add any extra color to the type of oatmeal soap I'm making this time. It just makes a nice, uh, it just makes the perfect shade for a honeycomb look. So I'm just gonna keep the batter the whatever color it turns out. But oatmeal in soap gives like some mild exfoliants. It's a pretty gentle cleanser. It's just not a very harsh ingredient. It has a lot of vitamins and nutrients in it. It's just all around a nice additive. I want to keep the batter not too thick since um, I need it to pour smoothly, but I always, by habit, just make, <laughs> make it a bit thicker than I intend to. Sorry about my camera going out of focus. Um, I'm still getting used to the thing, but I think I'm getting pretty close to the texture I want it. Honestly, I could have stopped here, but I'm just kind of doing an S thing to make sure I get anything, any stray lumps out. Alright, now we're just going to let it pour now. The color turned out perfect. Now we're just going to add the bubble wrap to the top. Now this is going to make the honeycomb design. Last year I did this design um, a bit more vertically, if that's the right word. Um, the bars were, basically there wasn't, there weren't as many holes on it and they were only situated at the top, which I thought looked nice, but I think this is a lot more fun. So we're doing a more horizontal look this time. I didn't quite get the perfect color, but I think it's pretty close. But this is just glycerin soap that has been um, honey scented and colored to look pretty close to honey. 